Um, you get um, to mix it up with up B or side B. Uh, you can stall with B. So it's not like he's completely helpless. Like, of course, his options are not not great, but he has enough to make you doubt. You know, it's not like free to just decide, oh, I'm going to like edge guard you this way or whatever. Yeah. I don't know. Um, also, do you know that his side B has like a grab box in his back? So I didn't, I didn't know that. That's weird. <laughs> as long as he's moving and you're touching any part of him, you, you'll be grabbed. So. Yeah, I mean, from what I can tell, um, he doesn't have like a hitbox below him though when he's uh, side B. Doing it. Yeah. Right. So it's usually just like in his head area and his hand, of course. But um, behind like makes sense though, because like. Uh, this happens a lot with grab box or grab hitboxes in this game. Is if your character is moving like c considerably fast with a grab box open, uh, like it'll go behind their hurt box at some point. Because oh well, but you mean like uh, like dash attack, like dash grabs and whatnot. Yeah, right. Like they can go behind people. Oh no, definitely. I think uh, Zelda's standing grab uh, goes behind her. Oh. So, you can grab people that are like really close to you but behind you. Yeah, I think Mewtwo has the same thing. Mewtwo just has like a really... He has a weird grab box. I think Falcon has the same thing where like it's... It isn't too long in front of him, but there's like a considerable amount behind him too. Huh. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's like the T-Rex arms of grab seems... Yeah. Like, I think the only one with less range is Ganondorf's. Yeah, Ganon's grab range is pretty terrible. Which I guess that you could use it to justify the. Ch oh, oh my god. Oh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about nine. <laughs> but yeah. Yeah, you can use that range to like justify his power and throws. Right. I totally get that. Because. Um, I mean, I could say the same thing about Ness. Because Ness gets like a ton of throws. Right. Like, people always complain about Ness's down throw. And like, I can totally see them. Complaining about that because it is pretty broken. <laughs> like it's really good. <laughs> in this game, everyone has something that's a little bit broken. Yeah. Like always, like in a game that has Fox, you need to have everyone have a little thing broken. Yeah. If if you have a character that has a one frame move that can right. be used in like any situation, even right. for combos, you you gotta balance it out somehow. <laughs> I love Samus. Such a fun character. Yeah, Samus is super cool. I always love it when I see. I always love seeing Club play this character. Oh, he's so good with Samus. Yeah, it's it was the best. Although I used to play Samus in Melee, and I switched to Sheik when I started playing Project M, and now I brought my Sheik with uh, with me into Melee as well. Um, and yeah, I I guess that I kind of miss Club Samus. Because, I mean, it was definitely the best Samus out there. Yeah, no doubt. But, um, things that, outside of, like, spaces, what are her good matchups? You know what Cheeks does, does to Samus? It's just awful. Yeah, it's I, awful. The one needle cancels out fully charged, charged out. Right. <laughs> and, it's so stupid. Uh, needles just, like, deny Samus's bomb recovery. Just, yeah. It's awful. That matchup's just very bad. So, yeah. I, I can understand Flub trying to switch. And the switch to Sheik makes sense to me because they're actually kind of similar. Uh, they both have a really good Nair. They have the same uh, jump squat frames. Uh, yeah. They're, they can be used both to zone pretty well. Like, the main difference is that she can actually grab people. Yeah, like you never really get grabbed with uh, Samus. Unless you're Hugs and you yeah. get a thousand. <laughs> Hugs is pretty crazy with his grabs. Right. <laughs> <sighs> Game I watch. <laughs> the the biggest balancing part about Game Watch is that he's so easy to kill. Right. Like he's so he's I think he's the lightest character in the game. I, I think I I'd, I'd say so. Yeah, I think that Jigglypuff is. Oh no, yeah, Jigglypuff is lighter. No, but are you sure? I think that he's uh, 
he's uh, lighter than Jigglypuff. Hmm. I'm Could pretty be. sure. Maybe he's like the same weight, but his fall speed is a little bit faster. Because like Jigglypuff's, I'm pretty sure Jigglypuff has the slowest uh, fall speed in the game. Uh, like that's. I think that's data days before fast falling. Okay. Is it? I. We need to get yes. Ripple here to right. verify. <laughs> Yeah, he said he's not coming to this one. I don't know why. Um, so yeah. And like, Game Watch is also a pretty good combo food too. Which really? Is surprising. How, how so? Well, at least with for Ness, I don't know. Oh. I think Ness versus Game Game Watch is in Ness's favor just because like, he's one of the he can combo Game Watch pretty easily and um he can abuse uh. Game watches aerial lag a lot, especially with platforms. Right. Like, whenever I, f I face game watches, I always take him to stages with platforms because if they ever land with an aerial on a platform, I can just hit them right. like, every time. Even if they yell cancel it, the, yeah. the lag's pretty brutal. That's yeah. true. Except for back air. <laughs> yeah, back air is pretty safe, but yeah. even at that, like, I still hit them most of the time. And they. I mean, Game Watch tend to have a ha Game of Watches tend to have a habit of down airing um, onto platforms a lot, and I just like punish that most right. of the time. Oh, these, are, for example, characters that have trouble dealing with disjoints really can do anything against Game of Watch. Yeah. <laughs> um, like, and I'm not sure if Game of Watch can. I know for a fact that both Lucas and Ness can uh, absorb the hitbox of Din's fire. Yeah, they can. Uh, so, if Game of Watch can do that, uh, that just invalidates the Zelda match. <laughs> it just makes it impossible. I already think that it's probably one of her worst matchups. Uh, probably in the, quite next to Squirtle. Squirtle yeah. is awful for Zelda. Just because Squirtle is so small, right? Right. Yeah. Because Zelda needs the grabs. Like yeah. it's. She's a character that gets so much from them, and honestly has very little options besides uh, besides grab. Like out of shield, what does she have? Well, she has neutral be out of shield. Uh, that's not good. Not good. Because uh, the hitboxes come out like frame eight. Oh. So okay. it's not good. Uh, I didn't know it was that late. That's yeah. It's pretty. Crazy. It's pretty late. It's either six or eight, but it's it's pretty late. Okay. Well, project memes. Uh, Says that Game and Watch can absorb dense fire. <sighs> That's unfortunate. Are we starting wave two? All right. Well, it's starting now. So. Okay. So who's who's switching now? 